a heartbroken dad has shared a harrowing final photo of his 19-year-old son lying in a hospital bed before he died after taking ecstasy for the first time. Gareth Edwards took the picture of his son Josh at St. James's Hospital, Leeds, to raise awareness how devastating drugs can prove, hoping it may help prevent other families going through the same agony. Mechanical engineer Josh suffered a fitting episode on a Leeds street after reacting to ecstasy and cocaine he had taken for what police believe was the first ever time, Wakefield Coroner's Court heard. Police seized drugs and arrested seven people who had taken drugs at a house in Bramley, Leeds, during the inquiry following Josh's death in May 2017. All seven people arrested were released and faced no further action. Recording a verdict of drug-related death, senior coroner Kevin McLaughlin said a number of those arrested were too cowardly to fully cooperate with the police inquiry and had put their own interests before Josh's family. Mr. McLaughlin said Josh's death was a monumental tragedy. Josh's mother, Candace Edwards, 46, told the inquest, he was up for work at 6 a.m. on a morning, he just wasn't a drugs person. Josh suffered a fitting episode on a Leeds street after reacting to ecstasy and cocaine. Image, Ben Lack Photography Limited, speaking about her family's ordeal. After the hearing, Mrs. Edwards said, when I got to the hospital and they told me it was drugs I couldn't believe it, she added, he didn't deserve that tragic end, it was horrendous. Mrs. Edwards said Josh was family-oriented and hard-working and she had not seen any indication that he had experimented with drugs. In statement read to the inquest, Josh's father Gareth, 48, said, Josh was a dream son and we are immensely proud of him. After school he got an apprenticeship as a mechanical engineer and was thriving. Police were called to Victoria Park Avenue in Bramley at around 12 p.m. on May 14, 2017, after a member of the public spotted Josh having a fitting episode and falling down in the street. Josh, who worked at Pudsey Manufacturing Company Omco, was taken to St. James's Hospital where he suffered a heart attack in the accident and emergency department. He suffered a string of problems including internal bleeding and multiple organ failure and died just after 9 a.m. on May 15, seven days before he should have celebrated his 20th birthday. Josh died at St. James's Hospital in Leeds after suffering multiple organ failure. Detective Sergeant Lisa Watts said police believe the people arrested protected themselves rather than give police a full picture to investigate. Det Sergeant Watts added, We are of the opinion this is the first time Josh has ever used and it has had the fatal outcome, Coroner Mr. McLaughlin said, his body's reaction to the poison involved has cost him his life. It's a monumental tragedy for his family. Criticizing the people who did not fully assist police, Mr. McLaughlin said, they have chosen to put their interests in front of helping a family understand what happened. It would appear they have been too cowardly to cooperate with the police, Mr. McLaughlin added, if you take ecstasy or cocaine you must recognize that it may cost you your life.